I was going to show you, we did finally get the water with the nipple done, as you can see, and it's not leaking, which is great. However, make sure that you all strap it in, because as they get bigger, they'll be able to topple it over. But uh, right now, Miss Piggy is learning to play. Hello. And she is starting to come to me. How awesome. Let's get her over here. Get over here. No, no. And make sure you strap down the automatic feeder as well, because they will be able to flip that thing around, too. Yeah. So we're getting less bashful around us. Yes, we are. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we are. We're getting less bashful. Yeah. Yeah. Good girl. So she's had a really fun time. She's trying to get in with my chickens. And I have really been trying to get her to stop that shit. That board. Uh, and then my goonie coons. Look how gorgeous. Look how gorgeous. Come on. They're still skittish. There we go. They're getting there. Oh, don't get nasty. Get out of cold water. But yeah, we having fun. So, Miss Piggy. Miss Piggy. Miss Piggy. Miss Piggy, how are you doing? Look at those ears. Look at those ears. Oh, look, 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 look. Yeah. All right, y'all go play. You want me to rub you? Now, be careful when you do this. I have got my fingers smashed because they are lean in real hard. Yes, I have. Yeah. <laughs> she wiggling. So, yeah, we wiggling. We wiggling. Yeah. The good girl. That's a good girl. And Mama's good girl. Now, I wanted to um, kind of explain. See, look at that. How awesome. And it does not take but a little bit of peanut butter to put on that nipple. And bam, they understand that water comes out. Now, if you got a smart one. They will also understand they can make a waller hoe out of it. So some people with larger space, they put it on a pallet, which I need to as well for the snow. But uh, we actually put the, the nipple up high because she's going to get bigger. So from this point up is all water that she can really get to. And this point down is what holds the barrel in place. Look at her. She is like a scavenger. Like... I got all of this out of that pen earlier today. I'll clean this up later. I'm just tired. It was so cold this morning. Um, but she's a scavenger, and she really wants to play with shit. Like, she wants to dig up stuff, scratching her ass on that page. But we, we are going to, uh, in the next day or two... Start getting some more pins in here to uh, secure it a little better and get the Cooney Coons a bigger pin because we got to get ready for the winter. And so right now it's still hot. You know, we're in the high 70s and low 80s. So um, if you are wondering what this is, my Cooney Coons are actually potty trained. Yes, they are potty trained. And I didn't do it on purpose. I just threw that in for a slop bucket. And they decided to say, hey, you know what? We're just going to use our bathroom in that. And I'm like, okay. So I try to empty it out once a day. And that's where they just shit and pee. Which is great because it keeps the area clean. Very, very clean. They're very clean. So I love that. And right here, I just got my little... This is a very temporary um, spot. Um, I just got their little cage with some hay. And I mean, it, it's deep. It goes all the way back. And, uh, you know, just gives them something 
warm right now. <coughs> Miss Piggy with her little feeder. And that's her, her pen. So. But yeah, it is starting to get a little cool. The wind is freaking cold. It's been raining like every day this week. And I believe it's going to continue to rain every day until next week. So I'm, I'm not sure. But the wind is coming. I think yesterday was the first day of fall. I do. I do. There's my girls and boys. That is Dino. She is a bow tie showgirl. Super cute. Yeah. Hello. Hello. And like I said, these are, um, these are pets pretty much. I mean, you can eat silkies, but you don't want to. It's a greasy, tough type of meat and, um, it's black. Their skin is black. So, there's Splash. There's the rooster back there, Big John. Big John. I love the cook, uh, the walnut crisp. And I think we got another little rooster. I think we do. I thought I heard it trying to crow the other day. Now remember, these are only six months old. They're still babies. Then we still babies, ain't we? I don't see no more tomatoes. I mean, none that's red and ripe. We still have some blooming out. Sun's peeking out, so that is good.